Welcome to our channel. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry snubbed from royal gathering. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have once again been excluded from the Trooping the Color ceremony, marking the second year in a row that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have not been invited to the annual celebration of the British monarch's birthday. The event, scheduled for June 15 in London, will proceed as planned despite initial concerns about potential cancellations due to the upcoming general election and the ongoing cancer treatments of King Charles and Kate Middleton, who have been living in California since stepping back as working members of the royal family in 2020, will not be attending this year's Trooping the Color. The couple's absence from the event is not surprising, as they were also not invited to last year's celebration, which marked the first time the ceremony took place during the reign of King Charles, Prince Harry's father. The Sussexes are not the only royals potentially skipping the gathering, as it is believed that Kate Middleton may not attend due to her ongoing battle with cancer. Bokeh previously reported that the Princess of Wales will not be at the rehearsal on Saturday, June 8, and the inspecting officer role, normally carried out by her, will be conducted by Lieutenant General James Bucknell KCB, the palace has not yet confirmed whether the princess will be at the official event, stating that her work schedule is dependent on the advice of her medical team. Kensington Palace made it clear in January the timelines of the princess recovery, and we'd only be providing significant updates. That guidance stands, a palace representative said in a statement. Kate, who hasn't attended a public gathering since Christmas, is currently focused on her health and recovery. Royal expert Charles Ray expressed surprise at the lack of public sightings of the princess. No pictures of have been seen of the princess out and about. I'm surprised that with all the people who've got camera phones that we haven't seen her, but we have to accept that that she is out and about. Ray added, she's with her family, but the palace is making it quite clear that this should not be confused with her returning to work anytime soon. There are even some suggestions that she won't return to work probably until the autumn. And there's one suggestion that may not even be till next year. So that's slightly worrying. In March, Kate returned to Instagram to update fans on her health after months of avoiding the spotlight. In a video, she thanked supporters for their messages of support and understanding while she recovered from major abdominal surgery in January. Tests after the operation revealed the presence of cancer, prompting her medical team to advise preventive chemotherapy. Despite the tension between the Sussexes and the royal family, Meghan and Harry released a statement in support of the future queen, saying, We wish health and healing for Kate and the family, and hope they are able to do so privately and in peace. While the Sussexes remain excluded from trooping the color, King Charles is set to attend the event amid his own cancer treatment. Instead of riding on horseback as he has done in previous years, the monarch will travel in a horse-drawn carriage alongside Queen Camilla. The Ministry of Defense confirmed on May 29 that Trooping the Color would go on as scheduled despite concerns about potential cancellations due to the upcoming general election. Prime Minister Rishi Sunak's announcement of a July election had prompted King Charles and Prince William to cancel scheduled engagements to avoid diverting attention or distracting from the election campaign. 